Hi, again, our second video, we're going to check the first conditional. We have, we use the first conditional when we talk about possible future situations and their results. It's a high chance, it's a high chance to happen, but is not 100% true. And we have an example. If I study, I will pass my exams. Okay, now let's analyze the structure. Here we have two examples. If it doesn't rain tomorrow, we will go to the beach. I'll play video games if I finish my housework. Okay, in these two examples, I highlighted which read the verbs, so you can't identify the tenses. I know that you can because you are very intelligent. Now let's analyze the structure. So we are going to write a first conditional sentence starting with if, then we are going to have the subject, our verb in the present simple form, our complement, the comma, the subject again, now we are going to use will or want and you know that after this auxiliary verb we need the verb in the base form and then we are going to have our complement as we have it here in the two examples you remember that with the first conditional it's a possibility we are talking about future possibilities so is not 100% sure it's going to happen. It's just a prediction. Now that we have checked the usage and the structure, we can do an exercise. And it says, complete, the, complete with the correct form of the verb. And we have the first one. In the first sentence, we are starting with if, with the condition so, in the first part, we are going to use the present simple. If we start if we start talking, the boss will come. The result. In sentence number two, we start with the result, so we need will. He will be angry. If you, in this case, we need a negative. For if we use a negative form in the present simple, we need the auxiliary verb don't or doesn't. In, in this case, we our subject is you, so we need the auxiliary verb don't. If you don't, tell him. Number three, we start with the condition present simple. If I don't if I don't write it down the result I will uh, negative sorry I won't remember it number four with the number four we have to be careful because it's a question it's a question but we start with the result so if it's a question we are going to start will you call me if you get any news number five we start with the result andrea will negative and they won't pass if she doesn't study it's doesn't because our subject is she the last one we start with the condition it's if you ask her nicely she will 
help. Okay, so we have finished the exercise. I hope you understand. Okay, see you next video.